Back in Oklahoma, hundreds of truckers are making their way through our state on their journey across the country. They're part of a convoy on a mission to put the brakes on COVID-19 mandates. News on 6's Ashlyn Brothers is live in Big Cabin, where the People's Convoy is taking a pit stop. Ashlyn, what are you seeing? Well, Chen, we're seeing a lot, but we're hearing a lot of honking, too. I don't think that we've gone more than a minute without hearing a honk. Maybe every 15 seconds you'll hear an eruption from the crowd. And as soon as uh, the people's convoy, convoy got here, I mean, the crowd l literally erupted. I mean, it was crazy. There were so many people that were excited to see them arrive here in town. Crowds of Oklahomans are watching as the convoy travels through green country to say, let freedom roll. The mile long lines of trucks is traveling across the country. I mean, we're talking miles upon miles saying they're tired of restrictions brought on by the pandemic. and. Uh, truckers and supporters are calling for government accountability through transparent congressional hearings and into the national emergency declaration concerning the pandemic and the quote restoration of the U.S. Constitution. They are specifically protesting a mandate from the U.S. Department of Homeland Security requiring truck divers to be fully vaccinated if they need to cross land borders like Canada or Mexico. 50,000 Canadian truck drivers formed a similar convoy just a few weeks ago, and today we saw people pulling over on the side of the highway, lining the streets, gathering shoulder to shoulder on bridges and overpasses, waving American flags and holding up signs saying things like, keep on trucking. The convoy started in California and will be stopping in Veneta tonight on their way to Washington, D.C. Organizers say the fund is being handled by volunteer accountants and overseen by the law form and organizers say that they plan to leave for Missouri tomorrow morning and they aim to arrive in D.C. on Saturday night. Reporting live, Ashland Brothers, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.